An eight day trip to space ended with a splash tonight, 286 days later. And splash down, crew nine back on Earth. A SpaceX capsule carrying Sonny Williams and Butch Wilmore touched down in the calm waters of the Gulf of Mexico, concluding a saga that began last June. That's when the pair took off from Cape Canaveral, the first two astronauts to be carried into space on Boeing Starliner. A crucial test for the company in order for its capsule to receive NASA approval for routine flights. Let's get going. But issues with Starliner's propulsion system led to cascading delays in getting home. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas! As weeks stretched to months, NASA made the decision to bring them home on a SpaceX craft as part of the regular crew rotation schedule. Butch and Sonny will return with Crew 9 next February, and that Starliner uh, will return uncrewed. The failed test mission was a blow to Boeing Space Unit, which has struggled to compete with Elon Musk's SpaceX Crew Dragon. The situation even became political when U.S. President Donald Trump and his close advisor Musk tried to place blame on former President Joe Biden for the failed mission without giving any evidence. Posing for some final photos. And so today, in their re-entry suits, Wilmore and Williams posed for a few last photos before beginning the 17-hour journey back to Earth. Wow, we got a cute little pod of dolphins. It wasn't just one or two. <laughs> a pod of dolphins capping off a homecoming. Nine months in the making. Heather Wright, CTV News, Toronto.